Dr. Jeff's apartment above the clinic has been a good temporary home for Rosie. But today, he's taking her to what he hopes will be her forever home. That's cute. <laughs> I don't believe in altruism. That's just kind of my philosophy on life. I think, you know, you do things because you get something out of it. Well, I get a lot out of this. I mean, I really love doing, you know, I, I love my work. I'm lucky. I go to work in the morning and I love what I do. If I never see Rosie again, that's okay with me because I know she's going to be in a nice place. And that's real satisfying. So we're going to go do a home check. Dr. Jeff and adoption director Lindsay will make sure Elizabeth's home is suitable for a new dog. A brand new house. It's huge. Holidays for people in Elizabeth's position can be very depressing, quite frankly, because they can't do the things they've done in the past. So if Rosie makes that a little bit easier for Elizabeth, what else can you ask for from man's best friend? At the same time, uh, Rosie's getting quite an upgrade from where she was uh, on the streets. Hello. Hello. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, Jeff. Here everything is OK, and Rosie's going to be all yours here. Hey, baby girl. It's amazing. It's amazing. My lack of confidence trying to figure out how to live from this chair and not feel bad when I couldn't <clears throat> care for her the way that I know I used to care for my animals. You do the best you can with her, and I promise you she's going to love you no matter what. And if you ever have any issues, we're around, so. Yep. Good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. It's really good to meet you. Bye, Rosie. You have a good one. I need Rosie. And I hope that she needs me. Mm -hmm.